What's going on everyone? It's me, James, for Triple Threat FIFA, and today I'm doing a Chelsea 2014-2015 prediction team. But before we get started, if you guys want some cheap ultimate team coins, go check the link in the description to UT Coin Traders for Fast and Liable Swords. Let's get in the video. So first up we have uh, goalies, which are Petacek and Mark Schwarzer. Um, Yes, you may you might be where is Courtois? Where is Thiago Courtois? But I think he's gonna go to Atletico because he literally just won the Liga and uh, final of the Champions League. He didn't win Champions League, but got to the final one. To be honest, he's probably taking a step down. You know, like going to Chelsea. Uh, I think they got knocked. They um, knocked down the semis. I want to say they got knocked down in the semis by Atletico. I think, yeah. I came third in the BPL, you know, versus a team that got to the final of the Champions League. Almost won it. Like, seriously, almost there now. 90, 93rd minute header. And he just won the Liga BBVA. Or the Liga. So, I think Thiago Courtois will go to court. We'll go to a left to go. He probably, he'll probably be part of a deal. Sorry about that thud. Um, he might be a part of a Diego Costa deal or... Another few players deals from Atletico to go to Chelsea. He might be a bargaining chip there. So uh, yeah. Then also, uh, I think Schwartz will stay another year. He's 42, but I don't think he wants to hang up his boots yet. Then we have these starting defenders: Aspilicueta, Cahill, Benesia, and Ivanovic. Aspilicueta, I think will start. He's had a really good season. He knocked uh, Ashley Cole off his spot. Cahill again, another solid season by him. Um, proving to be a really good defender. Established, he's had a really good season with John Terry, but I think John Terry will be dropped to the bench because of this guy, Benatia. Um, they just sold PS, they just sold David Luiz to PSG for a lot of money, and I think a lot of, and I think pretty much that money can be spent on Benatia. Uh, from Roma, like they have, they have set a really high price tag for him, but I think they'll. I think um, Roma could sell him, and then we have Ivanovic, who's had a really good season, and uh, he's a solid right back. So that's that's the team. That's the starting defenders. And then we have reserve defenders. John Terry, like I said, uh, I think he'll be pushed down to the bench. Just younger, younger talent will be coming in. Uh, Fleet Bailey least uh, he could be, like I said, could be involved in a Atletico trade. You know, with Courtois and Diego Costa. He could be part of anything. Just as a reserve left back, because Ashley Cole's leaving. And then Rafael Varane. He could be, uh, he's heavily linked. Um, Chelsea could spend the David Luiz money on him too. Varane, um, he's 21 as well, so he's got a long, if he does sign for Chelsea, I think he'll be in a long term, so, you know, 10 plus years. That's pretty good. Um, so yeah, I just think those are going to be the reserve defenders. And then uh, that's that's it. I think I think that would be one. This would be a really solid defense, guys. Like seriously, the only weak one would probably be him because he's like young. But, but these three form an excellent partnership, you know. And then ask for the Quetzal would learn, or you could put in Felipe Luis, and like dang, you know, you would have a really strong defense. But onto the midfielders now. We have. We're going with the 4-2-3-1 lineup, so with two defensive mid, Matic, really good um, half season at Chelsea, signed from Benfica in January. Oh crap, didn't mean to do that. Um, I also Ramirez has had a really solid season. And then up top, we have Hazard, really amazing season. Oscar, pretty good season, and Willian, who settled in well, you know. With the team, I think this is gonna be a really strong midfield. I think the only weak point would probably be Ramirez, maybe Oscar too, because they're young. They're pro Oscar's really weak, to be honest with me. To be honest with you guys, uh, he might. So he might be the weak point. Hazard, I think Hazard Matic. This side, if they play it like this, this side is a strong side. Matic, great defensive midfielder. Hazard, great attacking midfielder. Um, Willian, he's pretty good too, but, you know, this is gonna, this is what I think the starting midfield lineup will be, like I said, 4-2-3-1. This is, guys, this looks amazing, you know, seriously. 
And then we have um, the reserve midfielders Ander Sharla, Seth Fabregas, and Mohamed Salah. Salah signed from um, SC Basel in January, and uh, Fabregas has been offered 30 million to four Premier League clubs. Uh, Arsenal, who have a buyback clause, Chelsea, Man City, and Manchester United. But Barcelona president has said he doesn't want him to leave. I think he could leave. Um, he'd be a great center forward on FIFA. And then Andre Schala. Andre Schala. Signed in, signed last summer. Uh, I think from Bayern Leverkusen. And he's been, he's done really well, but Jose Mourinho doesn't think of him too good. But that's the reserve in photos. And if you didn't know why Frank Lampard or you didn't if you don't see Frank Lampard don't worry or well if you don't know just forget that but Frank Lampard has signed for NYCFC Manchester City's uh, own club own MLS he signed so Frank Lampard is going over to America um, they don't actually play till next March or next February whenever the season starts I know some start in February some start in March uh, David Villa also could be on his way over there. So, you know. NYCFC getting all those uh, really good, experienced players. But yeah, uh, Frank Lampard is leaving Chelsea. That is confirmed. I will show you guys the end of it on Twitter. And, you know. Seriously, if you just check in the next couple of days, just search Frank Lampard. You'll see that he signed. And then starting track is we have Diego Costa. The beast from Spain. Um... You know, there's not much to say about him. He that he's really good. He scores his goals, and he is Chelsea's. He is the replacement for Chelsea's striker problems. That's kind of it. You know, he's beast. Most goals in the league, I think, over CR7 and Messi. Um, he'll get you the goals. Chelsea, if Chelsea sign the players that I think they will, they will be seriously a force to be reckoned with. I expect them to probably win the BPL and. When the when the Champions League, if they make these signings, but they have to make these signings, and you know, the, remember these guys. These are only rumors. I will only tell you. I will I will tell you if they have signed. Um, I'm gonna be starting up my new. I'm gonna be starting up a new series in the next couple of weeks. Um, that are gonna be you know, um, like transfers that are going through that are confirmed and. You know, big signings. So, like, let's say Cruz. I know he probably won't be. But let's say he goes to Man United. You know, like, Cruz. I think he'll do well, you know. And I'll give, like, five players an episode. But that's for the future. I'll talk about that later. Um, and then we have Fernando Torres as the backup striker. Now, this. You might be thinking, okay, where's Lukaku? Where's Eto? Where's Ba? Then Ba Ba, he's, uh, he's been linked to Besiktas in. out in Turkey. Uh, Eto, I think, only signed a one-year deal, so he could be moving somewhere. He's, um, I think, on BBC website somewhere. I said he wanted to go to Arsenal. I don't know if that's true, but I don't. I mean, he could leave. Um, it just depends. I mean, but I haven't picked him. And then uh, Romelu Lukaku, he has been linked in the Benatia deal, so it's like it's like I think it's like 18 million plus Lukaku for Benatia. Which could be good, you know, but um, that's kind of it for this. Um, we're on the we're kind of on that Chelsea vibe this week. Uh, we did a player predictions part one on Thursday, go check that out. We didn't upload yesterday, um, I just didn't have the time. Simon and Oliver are going on a camping trip this weekend, or well, they're already on it, so they couldn't upload. But tomorrow, we're gonna be doing well, I'm gonna be doing a Chelsea part two player prediction. So if you guys want to see that. Hit the like button. And then, guys, so let me just show you a couple things on the internet. The mysterious world of the internet. So, like, there we go. Frank Lambert will join NYCFC on a free transfer from Chelsea. There's so many things about this. Um, uh, you know. Frank Lambert signs for NYCFC after agreeing a deal. After agreeing the deal at Man City's current training complex, so he is gonna go. And also, guys, I just want to let you know on the giveaway, we do have 45 subscribers. We're only five away. 
hit hit the subscriber button get your friends to subscribe you know go 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 get them get them get them um and then on the noise giveaway video we do have 11 likes so thank you guys so much for that and uh so yeah if you have enjoyed this video leaving a like would be seriously awesome um chelsea like i said chelsea out tomorrow and uh so yeah hit the like button subscribe check out our coin sponsor and our links in the description and have a nice day guys